Eleven. Yeah, DJ Sporting. Current day, the issue of best eleven is not on my plate now. What is what is really important now is the the composition of those players that were selected is is highly disheartening. You know, I'm not I'm not far away from where where this uh, this tournament is going to take place. Uh, okay. I'm just a stone throw away from from there. And uh, there's a player in that particular city called uh, uh, Raji Rife. Yeah. Oh yeah. He's a yeah. He plays for that 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 city team. Uh, Hatana Sport. Uh, he's a, he has a librarian. Yeah, he has a librarian background, and he's one of the happiest strikers now in the league. And coming that city to play, and there's no discussion around him whether they can talk to him to you know to 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 play for Liberia. You know, we see the Nigerians, they, they send a scout, they send some of the FA officials across Europe. They talk to players behind the scene. And we are not seeing it from Liberia. Where they are playing now, we have a, 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 a potential struggle there now. He's the happiest now. In fact, he scored last weekend uh, against uh, 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 Fanabashi. Yeah, in the Turkish league. So there's no discussion around him. In fact, the issue of uh, the striking force, you talk about Bashemo. I mean, we haven't seen Bashemo for long. We need, we need some new, new faces. Yeah, we need, we've been seeing Bashemo around for long. You know the character Bashemo? Yeah, but, but let me he been, he been. Uh, yeah. Diallo is in the team. Diallo is there, Vin is out, uh, Sam <laughs> Jones is out. <laughs> May laugh, but the backup square coins with Diallo. I mean, look, if I if I if I if I let me tell you something, uh, the Diallo issue, it was a celebration from that, that particular team in the CVD. This is the Whoa. first ever player from CVD to play for senior national team. You get I me? Mean? It's it's actually it's actually disheartening to take a player from where CVD. It's 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 yeah, I know. So it's a serious issue, but we 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 hope to see. In fact, it will be not far from us. They, they, they are they are playing the near us here, but we will see what will happen at the end of the day. But I think the team that was that was that was selected to my to my own view uh, will not make any impact. Yeah, yeah we will not make any impact. The regular goalkeeper out. Let's go to Lawrence. Lawrence, the two goalkeepers out. Tommy Sango, Ashley Williams. And now, how you look at it? Too? What's going into speech and mind at this time to draft the two regular goalkeepers that we may use in the qualifier? Well, um, for the for the issue of... Okay. You? Okay, yeah. So, for me, uh, really, for when it comes to Actually, situation. I think uh, people might not agree with me, but I think uh, Peter Butler was right on this one. Why? Actually, just came back from Europe. He need time to relax his mind. He just came back. He need time to relax. He need time to play a little bit. Actually, well, in Spain, he was not playing. He was uh, he was not playing active, so he need a little time to adjust. For this friend, actually have had actually got the experience already. He just need adjust adjustable time time to adjust himself. Uh, for Tommy Sango, I heard that he was bereaved. That's what that's the problem. Either he's bereaved or his mother is seriously sick and he's the one. I don't know whether he still she should be the one that fully taking care of her. Like they don't have siblings or so. But I think that's they say he put in that excuse. But if he didn't, then I think Tommy should have gone at least. If even he will not play, you want to try other bookie ball. He can be there to guide the younger ones for experience because he's been in the team and been playing. But for Ashley, I think uh, Ashley just need a, need a little break. That This alone can serve as a motivation. He'll be like, oh, wow, they're leaving me out now, so that means I have to throw it up. I have to throw it up. I have to put myself together to pick up and stuff. I should have been on that trip, but maybe my performance is not improving, so it's not encouraging, so I have to work on myself so that I can be able to get to the level that I will be caught up. I think this should serve as a motivation to him instead of being discouraged. That's why I feel yeah. because Kelly, then he was yeah, not I, yeah. Let, let's, let's go to this thing, right? We, we, we got the players. We know that we need uh, uh, some level of improvement in terms of selection. But do you think with the number of players going to Turkey, Coach Butler will stay with his <laughs> defender system or 
full in the back. And then after that, we go to we go back to Lawrence to get his view. So you get uh, one minute to push your point if Coach Butler should stay with his TV defender or he should change or you think he will. Okay. For for the issue of three defenders, uh, when we when we analyze morning forward now, we have something called wing backs. Playing with three defenders it means that you are playing with wing backs. Uh, a defender that will go attack and return. So I don't know. I'm not with Boiler training to know that uh, he have some of the players that have a quality to play a wing back role, like what Oscar Dolly is doing currently on the on the on the Savia Pra. So if you have such a player in, in, your, in your team that can play wing back, go and come with, with that stamina, I think he can play with a three defender strategy. But regularly, Lone Star traditionally, we play our 4 4 2. That is four defender, four midfielder, and two strikers. Yeah, that's what I know of when it comes to Lone Star. But if you want to introduce a, the regular wing back system, then you will have that player to, to, to perform that role. Okay, and uh, Lawrence, would he talk about? If there's stamina in among the players that can implement that system, we should call it very catty. Because in first division, yeah, it's the same system our club will play this season. And bro, it been giving you a tough time in preseason for the guys to catch up with that TD defender system. Do you think Lone Star is ready to continue this TD defender system? Or it's time we go back to four in the back. Uh bro, to be real with you, right? These uh this system. If uh, it has contributed towards some of the, the downward trend in performance when it comes to the coach game, the team have downward, uh, have not performed up to standard on a Peter Butler because of this system. The Liberian uh, notable system is either 4-4-2 or 4-3-3. Uh, I, I like this kid from, uh, from Spa. I just went to Spa. Uh, he's a very good player. He knows how to use the line to go and come. Right, but you cannot depend on that in a with a, against a team that have a very aggressive look. It was some of the contributing factors that led to our Nigeria stuff. Although Tommy Sango had his own late thing going on, not Tommy Sango, but how he called this guy, Bozman Wani, that he needs yeah, the goalkeeper. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 going on back there, he go get causing penalty back there, yeah. but yeah, it has yeah. some effect on us, it has some effect on us. I think our traditional play style for me, I think Peter Butler should be able to base his current uh, team, uh, this formation should be based on 4 3 3. The lads understand 4 3 3 better than uh, 3 5 2. I think 4 3 3, where you have Jamel Argo, uh, Prince Buddy, uh, how you call him, Samson Duel, and uh, how you call him, from Spa. On the, behind that, but Mark. usually, you might have that. Usually, if you play with those guys on the, uh, uh, especially uh, Mike Papa on the flink, it will almost look like the same uh, stuff because Mike is always going, so you won't have that much problem. Mike can go and come by, he's good. From the I think two or three games I saw him play for Lone Star, he was eliminating on his side and moving, laying ball out, and taking on uh, players. So, I think we should play with 4 3 3. Instead of the 3 5 2, 4 3 3 will be a better formation okay, because Kevin. it will help the team to defend better and they have to attack better. Uh, Kevin, if <clears throat> looking at Coach Butler preparation now ahead of 2023 qualification, because maybe this is our biggest time we get opportunity to play TD games, maybe the next time will be a single game before we can go into the group stage qualification. Come August, if you work in the FA. The executive committee or Mustafa Radi or Henry Brown technical director. Will you extend Coach Butler contract and why you were extending or why you will not extend his contract? Yeah, I think if if I were in uh, the FA or at the FA, I wouldn't extend Coach uh, Peter Brother contract. The main reason is that Coach Brother have been have been uh, inconsistent. In terms of uh, selecting a stable team, yeah, he been very inconsistent, and we are still moving along up to the end of the year, 2023, which is the competition, and he's still inconsistent in terms of getting a a a, a stable national team for 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 Liberians. So for me, if it level me, I would not extend the contract. 
OK, Lawrence, you make decision, Coach Butler. Today is a D-Day, either with Joshi by result or with Joshi by promises. Which one will you go back? None of them here for further, none of them. I mean, say, you, you know. <laughs> oh, but <laughs> <laughs> let me be real. <laughs> Promise, fail. A stable team, fail. You, DJ Sport, and you've been reporting on Live Run Sports for the past, I think, one year and a half plus now, right? Mm -hmm. And I've been following you. As I'm not, you are the one asking the question, but I beg you, please, let me just ask the rhetorical question. You can give me a stable national team for Peter Butler today, today, and say, yeah, 